American Airlines flight from Manchester to New York is forced to turn back after mid-flight emergency. An American Airlines flight from Manchester to New York City was forced to turn back to England today after declaring an emergency over the Irish Sea. The flight to JFK was due to take seven hours after leaving at 10.23 a.m., but turned around east of Dublin and landed back at Manchester about an hour later at 11.24 a.m. The airline said flight AA211 returned due to a maintenance issue and that its team would get everything squared away and be wheels up again as soon as possible. However the flight was later cancelled, meaning all passengers will have to be rebooked on other planes or take alternative routes to New York. Emergency services were photographed as the Boeing 767 returned to Manchester Airport, and the airline told passengers in a tweet that safety is our top priority. The plane reached an altitude of 30,000 feet and a ground speed of about 430 knots around a half hour into the flight before it began turning around over the Irish Sea. One passenger called Sarah tweeted, We were in the sky for 30 minutes, and then there was a problem with the engine, so we had to go back to Manchester. I am not feeling good, so far it's not going too well but hopefully once we're back in the air it'll be okay, I hate flying as it is without actual stuff going wrong. American Airlines, based in Fort Worth, Texas, was founded in 1930 and now offers an average of nearly 6,700 flights daily to 350 destinations across 50 countries. An airline spokesman said. American Airlines Flight 211 from Manchester, Man, to New York's John F. Kennedy International Airport, JFK, returned to Man due to a mechanical issue. The aircraft landed safely and taxied to the gate. Our maintenance team is currently evaluating the aircraft. We apologize to our customers for the inconvenience and have rebooked them on other flights to New York. Yesterday the airline defended an unexpected pay increase for its employees, saying the raise was needed to keep pace with competitors and serve customers better. Officials said the increase will correct a gap between Americans' pilots and flight attendants and those who work for rivals such as Delta and United. It came as U.S. airlines face questions over their customer service in the wake of public outrage over United Airlines' treatment of a passenger earlier this month. United was castigated after David Dow was pulled from his seat and violently dragged off a full plane by airport security in Chicago to make room for an airline crew. American has faced questions of its own after a sobbing woman's baby was almost hit with a pram when an employee got into a shouting match with a passenger.